We just die a lot in this game. But anyway, I've learned that the anglerfish are blind. I also want to tame one and take it home with me. Uh, then now we uh, went on to a space shuttle that was hanging out with the cannon. So that happened. Um, all I know is that they went into the comet thingy and haven't come back. Two of them. That's all I learned. Oh, also I may have found the teleport to the sun station, but I'm unsure. Cause, um, died. Yeah. <laughs> but you know, progress. Progress is happening. Someday. I don't like the fact that it's like super pressury to get there before. Everything fills with sand. That's not my favorite part because I get distracted super duper easy. Like, obnoxiously easy. Hello. Yes, anything happened to you? I had to be like, no, this is your only task. Do this only task. Nope, never. All the task, all the time. Okay, let's not get spiked. We actually got here at decent timing. But look, I need all the information. I need it. If I see it on the walls. To it, I have to. It has to be a thing. <laughs> Nemesis right here. last time. <gasps> I really was almost there. I am so upset right now. <sighs> this game. No, because what's over here? Pretty. Wait, is that the high energy lab? I'm assuming so. This doesn't lead outside, does it? go? Where does that one go? Okay, where does this one go? I'm going over here first.
wait a second. Where does that one go? Oh, that goes nowhere. Okay, hold on. You know what? I have an idea. That is dead. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Fine. This is a clever little bridge right here. Sixty seconds of oxygen remaining. That's fabulous. Sorry, I gotta get up there. And hope this isn't death. Ooh. door but this automatically came up for some reason. Okay. Freaking show. No my arriving at the warp receiver on Brittle Hollow very slightly before departing from the White Hole Station. Have I gone there yet? I don't even know. Very many are devising an experiment to test if this is a real phenomenon or simply a machine error. In theory, what we want to try to reproduce is a negative amount of time elapsing between something entering the black hole and exiting the white hole at its destination. Huh. So technically, there's two of them for a minute. Initial things first. Our experiment setup will first pair a small black hole with a white hole core to mimic the setup at white hole station. Okay. Hypothesis. It is possible for an object to exist to exit a white hole before entering the corresponding black hole. Yeah, correct. That does not make a whole lot of sense. It's fine. I'm sure it's fine. The Southern Observatory is asking if creating a 22 minute interval is possible, that is, to have something arrive 22 minutes before it is actually sent through the warp. Uh, we've learned the negative interval of time between departure and arrival can be increased by adding more energy to the warp core. Problematically, the energy required to extend the interval increases at an exponential rate. Creating a 22 minute long interval is possible, but we are currently unable to generate the necessary energy. Oh, is that how we got the sun station? Rami and I believe it would be necessary to invent a new method of producing energy, a surrealing but enormous undertaking. We would also require an advanced warp technology able to handle such energy. Mm hmm. Nope, too close. We would also likely need an enormous space to fit these proposed new energies and warp technologies together. The only location large enough would be the Ash Twins. The energy is currently unavailable, wouldn't you say? You're a gas pie. My pun was unintended, Remy, so I believe it is you who are our aeroform. Okay. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, I'm guessing this is the way out. It was original, like I got blocked myself out of these things before, so we are moving forward. <laughs> and it was died. Hi, Chef. How are you? I get the win. This is not what I meant to do. Thank you. 
the Ashman Project will be one of our biggest undertakings, metaphorically and physically. To build it, we would need a way to travel quickly between Ash Twin and each location that holds crucial project materials. But if you use warp towers like the one we have on the White Hill Station to connect Ash Twin directly to each critical location. Of note, each tower of Ash Twin will warp to a different planet. I've done warping on the towers, but I haven't been to the sun station. My gratitude to those who noted my imprecise language. Yes, the sun is not a planet. I believe this has been sufficiently clarified. Kind of not reminding me. We can design each tower to visually reflect its warp destination. The giant steep tower, for instance, could resemble a cyclone. Oh, we could put a model of the temporary tower after a geyser. Oh! Hold on. Hold on. You're doing well? Thank you, you tipsy. <laughs> okay. So that's Ash Twins, which is why it looks like that. I'm gonna guess that's Timber Hearth. Um, one of these is Brittle Hollow. But I don't know which one. Um, I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Oh, shit. Uh, Poke Root and I began work on this immediate, the Black Hole Forge. This will keep us busy. I need to get to the Black Hole Forge. And I'm pretty sure it looks something like that. I don't know. I'm very confused about this, though. I am well, though. Hey, it's been a decent day. go into the black one, right? And then we go into... Yeah. Uh, okay, you just always get sucked into a black hole. What if it's two black holes? Hold on. What happens? I need to know. Nothing. How rude. Okay. Is there a difference between, like, that? That's so always like that. Yeah. I mean, is it just. Okay. <laughs> I guess it's the testing site anyway. It's a lab. Feels good. Hey, Gan, I hope you've had a fun filled day. Um, Alright, let's go over. Oh my god, where is the ship? Okay, we gotta find the ship. Mm, but we've been here now. So I can safely say we've been most everywhere except for there. We've been in here. like a room or something. It feels like it's a room. I don't know how to get in there. Could be a warp, I guess. 
makes sense, right? Because there's warps all over the place, apparently. And I've only found, like, two of them. <gasps> Hi, Professor! How are you? How you doing? Uh, you're heading to bed. Just wanted to stop by to tell you you're awesome and have a nice dream. Thank you. You're awesome, by the way. You. Hey, kids. I hope you had a good day. And that your night goes well, and your sleep goes well. And I just remembered I have coffee right here, so I am not sleeping. Sleeping is for the week. What? No. Sorry. <laughs> Enjoy your sleep. <clears throat> I have said nothing. Alright. Um, this, this, this is not great. This is, I don't want to go back. So one of these is supposed to look like the sun, right? I don't know what zone it is. The sun station? I'm assuming is the sun? I could be wrong. That one's broken. I don't know. Could be... It could be that one. That's... Oh, that's Giant Steep, the tornado. Don't... Don't... Keep. That's not what I wanted. I suppose it could be this one. This is the Ash Twins. Wait. Ah. Oh. Okay, I'm just following it. You know what? We're gonna go in this one. This, wait, this is Tempahearth. Wait, no. This is Geysers. Okay, hold on. I got this. Team, I am schmert. But I'm slowly rolling up on that, so I'm not, like, super smart. I will wait for you to pass. <laughs> uh, it's fine. If I figure this out and I die right away, I'm gonna be mad. Alright, we have fairies now. I'm gonna put a fairy down. I accidentally bumped into your YouTube last week. Nice to meet you. Hello, Im Immy? Razik? Lovely to meet you. Welcome on in. Um, well, thank you for bumping into my YouTube. I hope you enjoyed it. The sun is so about to explode. If this is brittle hollow because it does not look like a sun but it does look ooh, rocky no 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 this is giant steep but we know this just call me emmy sounds good lovely to meet you You know what? Maybe we do want to go. You know what? We're gonna go. Wait, do we really want to go to the Brittle Hollow one? Because at this point, Brittle Hollow is like empty. Because we know this. Because we've been there. Oh shit. Why am I gonna run into everything? Why is that happening? You know what? This is kind of a sun. I don't know what this is. Where do you warp to? This is the only one I can't determine. So this could be the sun station. Theoretically. Can you land, please? Okay, let's see. Is 
you know, it's very possible it was the sun station, but now it is broken. This is why I had to do this before. I was doing this before, but I did not realize what the point was, and now I do. Now I do. I think this one's about to explode. No, oh, you're going expert mode. Yes, I am. about to explode. Goonies. <laughs> I figured out the warps. Kind of. Schmidgen. Okay, we'll do the thing we did in the high energy lab and I'll just arrive before the sun sand <gasps> depletes. That should work, right? Theoretically. And it's just backwards of what we did for the sandy side. The unsandy side. Right. We got this. It's fine. Yeah, the warps were confusing to me because I'd be like, what icon goes to what planet? Um, I still am not 100% sure which one's Brittle Hollow. I think it's the only one I can't identify, which... Why do you keep doing this? Um... But the tornado one they said was, um... Giant Steep, the geyser one is Timber Hearth, and the twins are the two planets or two bridges or whatever. But the other two I'm still not completely sure where they go, but it's good enough. Yeah, the twins are easier. I mean, fair. They do have bridges. I'm dead. I'm not dead. It's fine. I broke it, though. Isn't it always my headlights? Is there a particular reason? The harder part will be trying to add Jadles! Figure out which is which. Hold on, let me land Jadles. In the insomniac? Insomniac. Hi. I love your name. It's adorable. Zombie and insomniac. Smurf. I like that. Fancy shout out. Y'all, if you haven't gotten to follow Jadles, you totally should. Super wholesome, super awesome. Amazing. I didn't realize it was a team thing. So, like, there's like winning and stuff. What's the premise of this? Space. Cat. Ow. 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 If I die, I'm gonna be so. Oh my gosh. Upset. Alright, I guess we're doing this on hard mode because I didn't get in here fast enough. <laughs> okay, yeah, we're dead. Anyway, um. So, yes, kind of. Except it's like Groundhog's Day? And there's no like material gathering, it's kind of like, or resource gathering, it's um, more like information gathering and every time you die you ended up in a loop, waited all that time and you were just a little late, listen, it's fine. You know, we're just gonna roast ourselves some marshmallow, 
Okay, it's gonna it's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. Okay. See? Good looking marshmallow. Stay here. We'll look up to the sun station. Now you have to deal with a sand tornado. What is that? I'm not entirely sure what it is. All I know is that it transfers sand from one planet to the other planet. And I'm not convinced the sand planet is a planet because it looks like it has a force field around it and it looks like a ship. I don't know. I don't know. That's giant steep. <gasps> sun station, take me. Is that where we're going? Bam! We did it! We're here! Does this not work? Why is here? Oh, there we go. Okay. You did it. Hell yeah, we did. Hell yeah. Oh, wow. 281 and 42,000 years ago. No user commands received for 10 minutes. All systems entering sleep. 10 minutes. 6 minutes, 51 seconds ago. Increased solar activity detected. Sun station hole integrity approaching critical levels. Closing emergency doors. No, don't close the emergency doors. I just got here. Also, what do you mean? Whoa. Oh, shit. 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 I did not. I better not miss that. No, I just got here. Please don't. was so much nicer there. <laughs> this is still this new. 